Hi friends, welcome to Zoe the Sassy Dog channel. Today we are going to show you an easy way and a little trick on how you can take your dog with you in public in uh, a convenient way, especially if your dog is tired or if you need to take public transportation, you need to walk down a busy street and your dog might have a little bit of anxiety or get easily distracted with so many people walking around. Uh, and we do this with the pet sling. I got this on Amazon. The link to the correct product, the exact product that I got, will be in the video description. So if you're interested, you can go and check it out and buy it. It's medium price, I would say, around $22, but really it's worth the convenience. Just make sure that you don't just listen to the description that says for dogs up to 13 pounds, and make sure to measure the length of your dog uh, to make sure that it would actually fit, because sometimes these things tend to be slightly smaller than they say they are. Uh, but we'll show you how it works. It's really fun. It's really like a baby sling for your pet. And Zoe likes it. And we're going to take her on a walk now, so follow us. So right now we're going to show you how I normally do it. Um, Zoe's pretty good at cooperating sometimes. Um, you just make sure that the back legs are inside and the dog doesn't get out like she's doing right now and Zoe's a little bit long too so that's why I mentioned make sure that you measure your dog because I myself didn't do a great job but once the dog is inside you wrap it around your neck and you make sure come on Zoe you like this thing you've done it before you make sure that they are stable. See Zoe, as I mentioned, she's partly doxing, so she has a very long body. But at the same time, when I take public transportation or it's a street that there's too many people and she gets distracted, having this helps me because she has a little bit of support and I don't have to move my hands as much in trying to keep her calm. Can we try and turn around, Zoe? So we can start being comfortable in this thing. Come on. Hmm? And okay. And that's it, finally. This is what you want to accomplish. It might take a second. The pet has to find, you know, the way to put their butt in the right position. Okay, and let's go for a walk. Let's Zoe. go for a walk. Yeah, is that okay? Is that okay? And what I notice because when I take the subway to work, uh, there's people, and obviously it can be challenging to for a pet and for a dog owner to deal with moving in the subway and some people are bothered by dogs too by the way um, which I'm like how can they be she's so cute uh, but this provide more stability for them they try to get out of your arms less they feel less anxious um, because sometimes she would shake if there's too many people she doesn't know around and she has no idea of what I'm doing or where I'm going. Help their anxiety, make it a little bit easier on you. I 
hope you enjoyed this video. The link to the product will be in the video description uh, so that you can buy it. Remember to follow us if you don't already, Zoe the Sassy Dog, on Instagram and Twitter. Subscribe to our channel. We release video twice a week. Have a great day. Zoe the Sassy Dog. <laughs>